I think Shrub wants out of the band. Um, no, I think he's just, I think he's just sad. He, he, he told me, and I'm, this is a, this is a, this is a full quotation. Okay. Um, I'm just not really into tortoise dust music, end quote. I haven't been into it since the first time we were playing, so I'm pretty sure he'll be all right as an interim member. I'm pretty, I'm pretty sure that Tortoise does transcend Shrub though as a person. I don't want to in my presence. What, what exactly? What exactly did I say? Yeah. Do you have a good day, Justin? I've had worse days. Okay. You are. You go off on a tangent about beer and life and philosophy and your schoolwork. And I just can't. It's a child. I just can't handle it anymore. I'm up to here. Is this how you would speak to a child? Just yes, like, you are a like, child. Like, you like, little like, ass. No, no, that, that's not what. That's not what's in question right now. Is this how you would speak? Is this how you show your love? You know that a child. This is exactly how I show a child a chi like you love. Uh, I'd like show you a no child. Love. A child's mind is like a shamwow. It absorbs everything and retains everything forever. It's like a sham. It's like a shamwow. Yeah, that but you would can't you have money to buy the shamwow? That's where you're Ever. at. You're too fucking. Heard. What was that? That was the stupidest thing I have ever heard. And you know what? Sherb is right. You know what? He hangs out with Shrub, so he knows what stupid things sound this like. Is, this is his home. This, these are his ten commandments. And, one, and two, here. Commandment number one, thou shalt not be a bitch. I think I, I, shit, I cannot go tomorrow to that thing. Okay. Easter dinner, Diaz, Diaz house. Nice. Mm -hmm. Is Johnny gonna be there? No. He's still in San Francisco. I'll tell you about it. Matter of fact, I gotta call Mr. Diaz because it's also Letty's birthday coming up. So I need to get her a present, but I don't know what the hell to get her. So I'm gonna get her a present. Ah, oh, I gotta get a bottle of wine too. Gotta write that down. For no, just for dinner. And I know what it's like to be a dancer. I know what it's like to breathe softly. And I know what it's like to be a particle of dust in a torment. In a torment. I know what tornado. it's like to move quietly. I know what it's like to make noises in an old house. I know what it's like to have divine knowledge uh. of need. Like we did for dissection. How we kind of put it back jam and then we recorded us like talking, smoking cigarettes and shit. Just do it exactly. check and see that it's all in the same master, right? Because, see, we have one tape here, and tape is expensive, we're running out of tape right now. You can use a little di digital, like a little didgeridoo, where you're like, nom, 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 and you're fine like that, and you, you, you don't even care. But I, I'm trying to do, thanks. Thanks, Justin, for uh, trying to get me my livelihood. You're welcome. You wrote that? No, just stop talking about your books. Oh, just, I'm sorry. Just because he can't read you, like you keep saying, like, oh, listen, I was reading uh, uh, Platon, the, the the Colosseum by Platon. You've heard about that, you? Because you're. I thought you're it was the Republic. Republic by Plato. No, no, I no, was no, once, no. I wrote as no, registered Democrat. I think you're mixing it up with Star Wars. Yeah, that's Star Wars. I'm a registered Democrat. Star it, a, 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 a well, kids are a starving in Africa, and you're wearing a stupid safety pin on your. I'm there to hold it in place. You need to get new glasses, man. My dad was like, he was, was in Mogadishu during that. Like he, he actually took, 
N no, he was with the Navy. Ooh. Was your dad he was a doctor Black Hawk there. down? Yeah, dude, my dad's a Black Hawk and he was down in Mogadishu. Was he down? Why? He was getting down in he Mogadishu should, with the Black Hawk. Wait, so he shot Mogadishu. down? He was with the hockey team? And he's a doctor. He's a really, really skilled individual. He's a Black Hawk, a hockey player, and a doctor. A Black Hockey player. Yeah. Alright, I can't be in the same crowd as this. I can't top that, so... I think, like, all the ego that we could possibly, like, wait, wait, need wait. collectively, I think Renz... Renz is, like, the ego of the band. Can you, uh, tell us about your experience in the past ten years since the, uh, recording of the groundbreaking Tortoise Dust album? Was well... It, wait, 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 the groundbreaking Turtle Dust album from... What was ten years ago? To carry the... 1998. Carry the two... Yeah. Um, what have your experiences been like since then? What, what have you, exp like, what's, like, what's, uh, what's been going on? Reds, uh, so what have your experiences been like in the past eight years since the grow? recently. Mm-hmm. Who have you been acting with? Acting like a bitch? Justin, you're the singer, right? You're the, you're the, you're the... Yeah, I'm the, uh, I'm the vocalist. Hey. Go ahead. You see that lighter show? One second. Yeah, I. Mm. What's nope. the magic word? Now. Thanks. Um, you know, I just tramped through France for a while. Really met up with like right Charles now. Baudelaire and Arthur Rimbaud. Can you and, hold this for a second? Keep to, keep talking. It's pretty talking. it's pretty great. Okay, why can you why don't you why don't you interview me? Oh, I'm not really in the band, but I okay. think this would be my Shrub, Um. So, what is your experiences? How, how, what, what have you been experiencing since the uh, last Horse Dust album? Uh, Turtle Dust, sorry. Well, there was a time where I took a peyote for about a 15 months straight. Um, I, I heard that you were in the band Paper Cut Butthole. Nice. Is, is that true? How, what kind of music do you guys play? It's based on my experiences with paper cuts and buttholes. I'm still in school, you see, so I'm, I'm trying to figure out... You see... Which one? Like, seeing... Oh, the scene? No, no, like, seeing. Like, seeing what what's out there, seeing. Seeing. You see? What do you think of the medium of your music? I wish it were large, I'll tell you that. Talking about the as of yet unreleased winter album that you said you were working our, on. Our producer, you see, our producer had this idea for it, and he hasn't really brought it to light though. He's yeah, like, yeah, but he's the kind of a he's kind of a fucker. Yeah, but the press copies that were sent out no, of the no, rough no, mix no, did no, not. No, 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 I will, no. I would no, like no, to speak no, about. No. Right he studies at Berkeley School of Music. And for jazz and, and how's he doing gra grades wise there? He has an A in douchebaggery 101. Are you guys talking about Berkeley? Taking summer school. I'm glad we can do this interview because you declined to interview last time I was here. I, I did I did decline. About 16 it's, years it's ago for the spring I break did, album I, single. I didn't really trust you then. And to be honest, I, I don't really trust you now. Because your music has actually, um, it's affected a lot of people in, uh, yeah, a lot say, of people really hate it. Let's say an, an overall negative it. way. Yeah, it's, it's. What do you What do you think about that? I mean, I don't really care, to be honest. I sneak up. Renz doesn't really like it when um, people watch him play drums. But I'm just gonna sneak. Up. It's Renz on the drums. Um, wait. I know I'm supposed to be an engineer, but 
But I, as I told you, I switched my major. I switched my major at Berkeley, uh, School of Music. No, I'm, I'm taking online. I'm taking online classes, but it's for, it's for jazz drumming. Look, listen, listen. Let me see. Let me see. Look, listen to this. No, see, that's just wrong. It's cheating. You lost your fucking drum set. No, you don't even listen, know where it's at. Listen, check it. I promise, I'm taking all my course and everything. Check it. This is what I was doing earlier. You don't break my drumstick. No, oh, look, no, well, yeah, dr drumstick, huh? Like, I'm used to having these. It's like there's more tape on the bottom. I mean. Yeah, let's get started. Hey, Jeff, do you know how this works? Nah, you see this thing? Do you know how it Come works? Come on, man. Dude, dude, flip it on me. I don't really know how to help him, but he's, oh no, dude, I got it. Check it out. He's he's serious. I, I don't really know how to help him. You see, in in the ward, this is our time to let to let the you know the inmates. I, I mean the patients, the patients, the clients, the clients, if you will. We we let them go about their daily lives with music. It helps them to. Uh, yeah. To release their inner energies. For instance, our um our drug addict Shrub over there. He's not even aware that he's actually in an insane asylum. He thinks that he's about to drum. Stop, Stop, it. Stop it. Really? You know, man, prison prison's a pretty fucking crazy place, and uh, uh, nowadays I'm just uh. Just kind so of, you were in prison for 15 years doing no, peyote? No, I was. I was. That was. I would. I never. So I've never done metaphor, peyote. Like um, but so I've been floating like around from That's here and there, playing no, in a few prism. acts prism. like uh, oh, the Ramium and the Shrotum Shlubs. Because I never play it. Because it's come to a point where I just was just gotten so skilled at it, I had to put it away and really forget everything that I've ever learned. As you can see, it worked really well. It's been a few, few months or so since I last touched this baby.
not as good. Yeah. This Better. actually reminded me of a lot of the Minutemen, if I can even say that. I mean, oh yeah, that, that one thing, yeah. It sounds like I'm an old fucking woman. <laughs> Holy shit, that's been smoking for like fucking 50 years. Um, oh, don't delete it. Do not hit delete. Can't you undo? Here we go. Well, dude, this is so fucking cool. We can probably find a way to figure it out. Some people have a problem with quantifying things, but, you know, 10 years ago, I was probably like the fifth best guitarist here. Like the fifth best. That's what, that's the word on the street. That's just, I didn't say that. Those were not my words. So, I'm just kind of repeating, you know? And not to say it doesn't feel good, because I think, I think I'm at least the fifth best. Yeah, to, to put it frankly. So. But you know. here because the clouds are very inspirational for um, for how how I express myself while, while I'm playing with the shrub and and uh, Mr. Justin Neff. Don't ask shrub because he had, he would probably not know what you're talking about. Don't ask shrub. No, he'll know. He probably knows most out of all of us. But, see, he has a drug problem, and he's not actually really listening. But it may seem like he has no idea. But he has a very good idea of what's going on if he, you know, whenever he's not drugging, like, self-drugging himself. But he's a good person, though, I mean... I don't have a problem with him. I think he's a great guy. He's a very nice guy. Except for his drug, uh, drug smoking addiction. She's got black eyes. Back in the saddle. Boom, 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 boom. Don't you know where? Boom, 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 boom.
Wait, I don't you, know what I mean about... Can you just say reality again? I don't, I'm not sure I picked up. Try to enunciate a bit better. Reality. Reality. And I couldn't... For a while, it was kind of blackness mixed with a few splashes of color. 